Why classic camera angle is the best setting for you? I know full well that one of the biggest issues for people when it comes to turning over possession in EAFC is their inability to take touches first time to space and dribble to the space whilst at the same time keeping their back to the opponent. And this is the number one reason why people can't keep the ball. As we know, and as we've mentioned, people will take the ball first time towards defenders in this game, especially amateur players. And what this will do is cause them to lose the ball because they're taking the ball first time towards the defender, leaving them vulnerable, rather than taking it back into space or where it's away from pressure. It's the same with dribbling. As we know, one of the biggest mistakes is people will dribble, but they will try and focus on trying to beat the defender mainly and dribble towards that defender. It's not like that. It's not like you're Lionel Messi and it's not like you can dribble in and out of tackles that easy. You need to dribble to the space and keep your back to the opponent. And the reason why Classic is the best camera angle is because it will allow you to see the intricate touches of your attackers. I find when I'm playing at a higher camera angle, it is harder to see the intricate touches and it's harder to time your movements of the left stick. What I will say is, if you're wanting to dribble in and out of tackles, timing the left stick, point to a certain direction to keep it away from the defender and keep your back to the opponent is one of the most important aspects. And a camera angle that doesn't provide a closer look at your dribbling intricate touches when you're playing in the AFC will hinder your ability to keep the ball away from your opponent. And that's why classic 20 height zero zoom is one of the best camera angle settings you can have in the game it's not too far away nor is it too close because i know there are certain camera angles which are too close and they'll prevent you from seeing your players around the pitch but a camera angle that offers a, an ability to see very clearly the intricate touches of your attackers on the ball, whilst at the same time allowing you to see players around the ball is the best camera angle for you. Now, I am coaching one-on-one, -on -one, so you can check that out. The link to it is down below. There's monthly coaching classes. You can work one-on-one -on -one with me. There's even a lobby where you can request personalized tutorials from your boy to go and check that out. But yeah, I'm out. Sayonara, au revoir, adios, salam, ciao. Goodbye. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, then I'd really appreciate it if you hit the subscribe button. And lastly, if you do want any pre gaming fuel or supplement, then head over to atpscience.com, which is the first link in the description, and use the code DILLANETSATP at checkout to get yourself a discount. Not only is it the cheapest way to get supplements, but it helps me out a ton, guys. So thank you.